five years. That's a uh, it's a long time to me, at least. It's a long time. A lot of uh, a lot of struggles, a lot of positive, a lot of failures, a lot of attitude. It's been a ride. This is my home. It's where I grew up. You know, uh, changed who I was, changed the person that I've become to be the person that I am today. It's surreal at this point. You know, to be in something like like this, a featured match, that's something, you know, like to be able to sit back and be like, wow, like it was all worth it at the end. Like this is a cool feeling, you know. Three minutes. Three minutes. Your opening contest is a ladder match. And it's for the Hand Wrestling New England Championship. To be able to wrestle just for the New England title, like the amount of great people that have held that belt. You know, you got guys like Chase Del Monte, Adam Booker, guys like Ricky Smokes themselves, Brad Cashew, great people that have held that title. Now I get to have an opportunity to hold that title. And it's just, you know, it's just a feeling like, I I'm not walking out of here tonight without that championship. There's no way. Mortar making his way to the ring. We talk about Ricky, like the, somebody that I've considered my best friend for a very long time. Grew up with him, traveled the roads together, teamed together, had the same birthday together. Like it's just something that like, you know, it's, it's surreal to me now, like all these years later, how we've grown up, but also how we have grown apart as we came up as kids and now we're grown men. And now we fight like grown men. too hard to to fail today like this is just it's i'm not taking no for an answer i'm taking what's mine tonight very dangerous for mortar he is up mortar's on the top rope superplex and smokes rolls through oh a release reversal right there That Max Smash. Everyone who doubted him. Everyone doubted him. Not me. I knew it. I knew this is what he was destined for. What is your message right now to Mortar, the brand new New England champion? If you could go back in time right now and talk to CJ Cruz, who was 
kind of staggering, didn't know who he was, didn't know what to do, wanted to quit, what would you tell him right now? Keep going. Keep going. Don't stop. It all works at the end. Put the work in. You're gonna have bumps. You're gonna have bruises. You're gonna you're gonna be upset. You're gonna be um, at your highs. Like just just keep pushing. You know, um, the work is only getting started. The work now, like you have to work for it. You know, pretty much ready to take on whatever whatever chaotic brings. Like I've worked my ass off for years and established who I was and figured out like what works and what doesn't this works and this is me you know it's no more like happy-go-lucky clapping and dancing with the fans and like it, it, it's over it's done with like this is me i've worked so hard to get to where i'm at and now it's time to push take it to another level and keep that going good luck everybody else That's good. <laughs>